Hi, I'm Dr. Joni Liu, and I want to talk to you about why I do my cosmic tidbits. It's because over 5,000 years ago, the collective ego was created, and we began to be separated from nature, from the cosmos. So this is why my cosmic tidbits are so important, because over 5,000 years ago, we were given a gift counteract the collective ego, and it was called the Yi Jing. Now, the Yi Jing started out as being informational, giving us understanding and clarity. That was the whole point of it. But over time, due to Confucianism and Taoism, these philosophies got intertwined with the Yi Jing, and they became vessels of these philosophies instead of being its own pure self, which is just about the truth, okay, about, about a situation. But with the addition of Confucianism and Taoism, it became uh, vehicles of obedience, which then served the collective ego, because the collective ego wants you to obey its rules and its laws. Now, the problem with those rules and laws is that they're not universally applied. So somebody can break their laws and not be punished or not be rewarded in an untoward way. Let's put it that way. But if you break any of the cosmic principles of harmony, well, you're going to find out what the consequences are because no one or anything is exempt from them. Okay, so that is the difference. We can use the word universal, I guess, in this particular case, because those there's only a very few cosmic principles. And if you contravene any of them, you won't be rewarded for it. Because the word punishment doesn't exist in the cosmic way either. But the word punish is used quite often, trying to use it as a deterrent, by the collective ego, but it doesn't exist in a cosmic way. But what does happen is what you send out comes back to you like a boomerang. So if you send out good, it's going to come back to you. If you send out bad, negative, it's going to come back to you. And you don't have to wait for another lifetime for it to happen. So there's no such thing as karma because it's going to come back to you, <laughs> you know, in this lifetime. Eventually it will. Sometimes it's really instantaneous and sometimes it takes a while. So why do I do this? Because 5,000 years ago, the Chinese created a psychological system that was meant to help you to understand your world, to understand your condition, to understand why things are the way they are, and also what you can do about it. So I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.